We have two reported tornadoes, technically land spouts. This one video came to us from Central City by Christy Dudley, a kind of a really unique view of that storm. You can see how the swirls are at the ground connects to the cloud base. We had another land spout. This one is reported by Manchester. This photo by Brian, you can see it again attached to the cloud up here, goes all the way to the ground with a little bit of swirl at the ground. The land spouts tend to be pretty weak overall and they form in very different ways from your more classic tornadoes, both of which take a thunderstorm to be in place. However, the typical tornadoes that we see are formed by supercells. That means rotation is actually occurring in the storm itself, and that then creates the tornado at the surface. Land spouts are a little bit different. They're formed by just the updraft of the storm itself. You have all the wind converging at the surface, and that's what then gets lifted by the updraft. A little bit of rotation at the surface gets lifted by the updraft, and that then produces a land spout. So still technically a tornado, but form, it forms in a very different way. So far this year, the entire state of Iowa, we're up to 27 tornadoes. Again, all of these happened just in the beginning of late May and really quickly begin to ramp up. The strongest of which was still that EF3 tornado by Cantrell, Iowa on May 27th.